We just saw a baby be born. Welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to Babyland General Hospital to um, see how they make Cabbage Patch dolls. Well, technically where they're born. So, we're on our way there. We're here, guys. So we're walking up to the building, and that's the building right there. That's my cousin Lacey. That's the building, and that's my cousin Haven. And in the front with the puff jacket is my cousin Logan. We saw these large Cabbage Patch Kids sculptures. There was many of them in the garden. And now we're just walking into the building. When we got inside, there was little cases of the Cabbage Patch Kids, which were first called the Little People. In each case, there was a little bit of inf a little bit of history from Xavier Roberts and the Little People. As we walked around the room, we saw a whole bunch of Cabbage Patch Kids, aka the Little People. There was nurseries on both sides of the rooms filled with so many Cabbage Patch Kid dolls. As we walked through the hallway, we saw more nurseries with more Cabbage Patch dolls in them. There was nurseries on both sides, and some of the Cabbage Patch Kid dolls had Christmas clothes since it was the day after Christmas. As we walk into the main room, there are so many different Christmas trees and Cabbage Patch dolls everywhere. I felt so excited and I wanted to explore. And I wanted to hold every single one of those dolls. And one of the cool things that I saw was there was Cabbage Patch Kid doll nurses. Oh my gosh, that was hard to say. When we were walking a little bit further, we saw a tree house for the Cabbage Patch Kid dolls and a school bus. This is cool. And look at that little And I 
I just love the little desk that the dolls were sitting in. We walked over to Mother Cabbage, who is a big tree who makes the Cabbage Patch Kid babies. Some of the babies' heads were moving, but some of them were staying still. I didn't expect to see this, but there was a barn with a whole bunch of farm animals in it. And there was a hot air balloon above it with a horse inside. There's about to be a delivery. Hello everyone, how are y'all today? Is this anybody's first visit with us? All right, well no need to worry. I'm Nurse Chloe and I'm an LP in here at Babyland and that's just for licensed patch nurse and I'm here to assist on the couch their delivery today. Now I know she's gone into labor as the crystals at the bottom of the tree glow a little bit brighter and the bunny bees above our heads sprinkle down the magical crystal pollen dust and that helps us determine if we're having a baby boy or girl. What are y'all hoping for today? A girl! Okay, I did hear a bit of both so I am going to take a quick sonogram and see what we will be having. It does look like it's going to be a happy, healthy baby. And with all that pink, it does look like it's going to be a girl today. So the first thing I'm going to do is give Mother Cabbage a shot of a Magicillin. A Magicillin does not hurt or harm her. It just loosens up her leaves for a much easier delivery. Next, I'm going to give her a shot of TLC. Does anybody know what TLC stands for? Tender Love and Care. That's right. TLC does stand for Tender Love and Care. And here at Babyland, we believe in extra large doses of TLC. Next, I'm just going to make sure that she's still 10 weeks apart. All right, and she is, so we're off to a great start. Now she has had a couple deliveries today and is gonna need help with her breathing exercises. So if everyone could breathe in, and out. One more time in, and out. That did seem to help a lot because I am starting to see the baby's head and it looks like she's about ready to push. On the count of three, you need a more deal. Push as loud as you can. One, two, three. That was good, but I think you guys can be a lot louder than that. One, two, three. Push! And here is our baby girl. Woo! Now I'm going to wrap her up and tell you guys a few things I noticed about her. So the first thing I noticed is that she was warm bald. That's okay, it just means our interns forgot to fertilize her part of the patch last night. <laughs> the next thing I noticed are her big, beautiful blue eyes and her little outy belly button where I gently clipped her from Mother Cabbage. Now this next part can be a little bit embarrassing, so I need you guys to promise not to laugh. Can you say I promise? I promise. Just like all babies born here at Babyland, she was born with Xavier Roberts' birthmark on her little bottom. Mm -hmm. Now I'm going to wrap her back up because she is starting to blush. And before I take her over to the nursery, where she will receive her very first checkup, she is going to be the first in middle name. Do you guys have any suggestions? So she loves all those names, and it was a very hard to choice, but she has decided to go with Mia Audrey. The name like that should grow up to be a beautiful princess. Can everybody give her a big round of applause? Today is her birthday. We just saw a baby be born. Check the baby today. To the nursery and we even saw a doctor walking around to make sure everything was okay she checked the baby's temperature and then checked her heart Now it's time guys, we want to find our own Cabbage Patch doll to take home with us. Now this is cool guys, we walked into a room and there was a, a whole bunch of Christmas trees and they were all different. Long 
two pops. So if you get a pet, they they to have a sweet interaction. Oh, nice. You also got a lollipop too? Yeah, I can. Oh. The other one I got didn't have a lollipop, so that's why I got it. Yeah, oh. the, only, the other ones that I have at my house don't have a lollipop. Okay. Yeah, mine doesn't. After we left the tree room, we went to meet my aunts and the twins. That's Titi Didi, that's Aunt Luanda, and those are the twins. Layla? Also, um, let me show Layla the one I really like. Now, Titi's gonna help me find the perfect doll to take home. This one was so cute, but she wasn't the one, so we're gonna keep looking. Oh, I really like that doll, but I wasn't sure, so I went back to hold her. And then, Titi brought me a beautiful baby. Oh, Layla, that, I love that, her, that, that and that right looks there. just like you. Mm -hmm. Dark hair, mocha skin, mm -hmm. white shoes, white shoes, hot dog, oh, and she got pajamas pink. on already. Yep, pink shoes, look a heavy. Oh, hey y'all. Oh, go T T, go T T, go T T. <laughs> Alanda found two babies but couldn't decide if she wanted the boy or the girl. Found a baby and her name is Pat Tabitha. Pat Tabitha. Let me see her her tag. Pat Tabitha. Cool. That's like short for Patricia. You like it? Mm -hmm. I adopted a baby and I'm gonna get adoption paper. Are you ready to adopt her? Yes. Are you going to keep Pat Tabitha or you want to name her something else? Yes. Yes? Okay. What would you like to name her? Um, Stacy. Stacy, I'm going to close this just so we can hear better. On the back of Stacy's um, certificate, you will find her footprint and both of her footprint. You get to take the oath of adoption, which just simply means you promise to take good care of her, okay? Repeat after me. Say, I promise. I promise. To love my cabbage patch. To love my cabbage patch. With all my heart. With all my heart. I promise to be. I promise to be. A good and kind parent. A good and kind parent. And I will always remember. And I will always remember. How special. Stacy Samantha is to me. Stacy Samantha is to me. Congrats. Le Layla has a new cousin and his name is Nico. Nico. Oh, he's so big. Oh, we. Oh, he's so big. Nico Gale. And Logan, what's your baby's name? Lauren and Maggie. Lauren and Maggie? Yeah. We need two names. Yeah, that's first name and the middle name. She said that. I said Nico and Nash. She said both. So it's Nico and Nash. Nico, Nico, Nico and Nash. And Maggie. Maggie. Um, I didn't think of it yet. Okay, Maggie Lee Cooper. Maggie. Okay, guys, we just got back from the cabbage ca um, cabbage patch place, and as you might have saw, this is one of my babies that I got. I put my scarf on her. And my other baby here is right here. I haven't named her yet. So, yep, we're just gonna go back home.
Thank you everybody for watching my vlog today. Make sure you like and subscribe. Also, share this video with your friends and don't forget to hit the notification bell so you can be notified when I upload a new video.